Hello ladies and gentlemen, my name is The Face Stargist and welcome to Warhammer Space Marine. In this video we'll be taking a look at all of the skulls that can be found, starting off with chapter 2, since in chapter 1 there are none. So basically in the first level, after you go right down over here, you'll have the choice of heading forward where you actually get the first weapon. You're just going to want to head on over here, shoot this. Then if you head on over here, will be the first server skull. Okay, the second server skull can be found right off where you meet with the Codex Astartes guy. Basically, as soon as you progress, this one is a no-brainer. You can basically just collect it immediately. Okay, the third uh, skull can actually be found after you meet Mira. Uh, from the 203rd Cadian Regiment, right between these three diggers is the second bunker. And if you just head on inside over here, you can take it. Okay, so the fourth skull can actually be found as soon as you exit the trench area. And you basically come across here, you will have a grenade pickup. You're gonna want to head on over here behind, to the left. Then what you're gonna want to do is just go ahead and exit out of this building for the fifth one. Drop down. Go ahead and take care of them. Then what you're gonna want to do is just charge straight ahead. And blow that up. Go ahead and enter the bunker here. And that will be the fifth one. Okay, for the skull in chapter 3, the first one can be found right after you head on over here where you can see the shells being loaded. We're just going to want to head on over here to the right. And here is the actual skull. There we go. Okay, the second skull is right as soon as you descend uh, with the elevator down, it is located right on over here. About to run short of ammunition. There we go. So basically, straight ahead uh, from where you actually exit out of the elevator. Okay, server skulls chapter 4. Basically, as soon as you come across here, uh, you will need to cross this bridge, and there's the train basically before you cross this you're gonna want to head on behind here pick up this ammo and if you head to the left here you will see the server skull and that's it for uh, this chapter okay chapter 5 as soon as you see this big crane that the orcs are scavenging something to uh, to get you're basically going to want to head and over here, as normally as you would ascend up the ramp, you're going to go behind it, and here is the servo skull. Okay, as soon as you have that big fight and you actually descend down, it'll be right then over here to the left as you're going uh, through. And that'll be the last one that, we, that can be found on chapter 5. Okay, chapter 6, servo skulls. As soon as you get a side view of the titan like so uh, right after you identify where uh, the inquisitor is you'll have this little platform to the left here and there it is okay the last server skull right and over here where you need to where well, you first encounter the orcs that are coming out of these pipes over here you're basically gonna want to go from where you're supposed to go to the left here we're just going to head on up on this platform and grab it and that's it okay servo skulls in the seventh chapter the first one can be found right off uh, in the second room that looks like this so not the first one you counter but the second one and you're supposed to head on over to the right pipe you're going to head on over to the left pipe and there it is Okay, the last one that can be found in chapter 7 is right after you get the melt -a gun and you drop down the barricade, uh, drop down to the platform here. Just go ahead and blow up this barricade and you'll be able to pick up the servo head. Okay, chapter 8, uh, servo skulls. Right off what you see here in the ledge, we're just going to drop down and right behind us. 
will be the server skull. Okay, after we've entered the narrow corridor uh, with the melta gun, we're going to turn to the right and here will be the server skull. Okay, from the last server skull that we've gotten, we're just going to head on upstairs here. Just go ahead and head up the stairs. And it'll be immediately to the room on the left. So we're just going to look for an open room and here it is. Okay, so after the rock lands nearby, that is that giant meteorite. And you're actually going to want to descend down. You're going to want to pick up the ammo. Then what you're going to want to do is just head on straight forward. And we're just going to be sticking to the right side. As you can see here. Just going like this. Uh, this is for the servo skull, obviously. Right and over here. Take it and you have some ammo over here as well. Okay, server skull. As soon as you actually ascend this platform up here, what you're gonna want to do is just head on up here. This way you have plenty of those rocket la uh, rocket launcher gits, and they're basically the server skull can be found on this side by pushing just to the left here. We're just going to have to take care of these guys first. There we go. And it'll be on the leftmost side. So we're just going to go over this one. Nice, we actually got some combat in this video as well. And we're just going to head on over here and grab it. Okay, for the skull, as soon as you get the jump pack, you jump up here, you have this ammo pile, there is the drop pod where you got the jump pack. You're actually gonna want to proceed. Well, basically, jump up, you fucking blueberry. Up here, then, uh, ah, there. My bad, I actually missed the skull by a little bit. Then we're just going to proceed onwards. Okay, now for the next servo skull, as soon as you actually get up here, there we go. Basically from the rock over here, you're gonna want to head to the right of the staircase and that'll bring you to the service call. Okay, so basically after you deal with the orc psyker, you're gonna want to head on... Basically this is where he will spawn. That is where you need to go and you're gonna want to head on over here to the right. And over here you have a dead end. There we go. And you also have some ammo over here. Okay, for the next two skulls, you will come across this place right on over here. And instead of heading forward and over there, which is where we actually need to go to progress the mission, we're going to turn to the left here. And we're just going to go ahead and smack that. Right on over here, and here is the hollow tape. <laughs> next up, for the next one, we're immediately just going to head on over here. Then over here, then up here, and right on over here in the middle is the tenth and final skull of this level. At least I hope so. Yes, it is. Okay, servo skulls. So the first one can be found in chapter 9, right on over here. Where you have the destroyed bridge, you're basically going to want to head on over here to the left of the bridge. And you're gonna try not to slam yourself into a rock. Right and over here. Yes, perhaps. Okay, My the next server is called right and over here where you go so this way. It's basically very hard to miss. Okay, so the server skull right off where you go uh, near the actual end of the chapter will have to fight off against a bunch of these assholes. So we're just going to go ahead and do that real quick. There's some action up in here. So this will be that final skull. That is, this will be that final pipe. 
Got a bunch of grenades over here. Yeah, this is where they're actually firing rockets uh, at you from. Well, basically, just gonna want to head to the left, and here it is. The last server's call in this chapter. Server's call is in the 10th chapter. Basically, as soon as you hit this wall, you have these two turrets here that you've destroyed. You're basically gonna want to head to the right here. Go ahead and grab it. Okay, the second silver skull can be found in the Opal. Opal. Second silver skull can actually be found in this. Well, I destroyed you. Opal. You can actually be found in the second tier of labs, so right after you get the Kraken Bolt. As soon as you enter this area, you'll you can actually head on over here to the right then over here you'll have another turret which you're going to want to take care of once you take care of that turret the server skull will actually be over here nice look okay, at the last server skull can actually be found right on over here as you're looking at this works broke in through here and through here we're basically going to head to the right here and here it is. Me. Okay, servo skulls in chapter 12, Dying of the Light. There are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 of them. The first one is right off the bat. As soon as you drop into this pipe, we're just going to move on forward. Drop down here, and we're looking for an orc barricade. Which could be pretty much anywhere but I'm guessing it's gonna be up here yeah to the left there we go here it is okay the next skull can be found right on from the iron halo to the left here it is right on over here okay here we are uh, in any case, the next server skull can actually be found by heading up the stairs when you actually uh, take the ramp up. Captain, duty requires that I put voice to my concerns. Speak then. You held the unshielded power source again, Captain. And again, you emerged from the exposure unscathed. Small room upstairs. Okay. Uh, what what would you want me what would you want f fuck off cunt okay after you take the elevator down and you actually meet Mira as soon as you fight uh, your way to the other side of the room the server skull will be right in over here to the left of this, this is Bastion Primus. We're under okay the next server skull is right in over we're here while you're going trainers. through this uh, corridor and now we're just going to head to the right here. Apparently, there is approximately uh, the approximately over here. Mirror will actually get a box transmission, and that's your cue to turn to the right, essentially. Well, okay, the next server skull can be found as you're basically progressing through the level. Here you will get the plasma gun, and over here you can get the stalker bolt. Okay, so the next server skull can actually be found over here by the weapon crates as soon as you drop down here into the trench Where you actually go to restore the power That is where you will find the server skull The last server skull on chapter 12 can actually be found right before you head on through this door Right behind these crates over here it should be here. I can hear the sound, but I cannot see the skull. So it's not for me, but it'll be right down over there. Okay, chapter 13. The first skull can be found just when you encounter your first bunch of enemies here on this little Sodom 78. Here on this little catwalk. Basically, it'll be over here to the left. So go ahead and get it. There we go. And now we're just going to get out of here. Okay, the next server skull can be found right after you descend down in chapter 13. 
right after you send down the elevator right in front of you okay so the next server skull can be found from the central where you actually split for your squad as soon as you fight the raptor champion instead of going to the central room you're gonna want to head on over here to the left stratum 81 here it is Okay, and the fourth and final server skull can actually be found in the stratum 82 as soon as the titan, as you can see, he's walking basically from where you're supposed to exit to the left here you can actually find the servo skull Hello, chapter 15, servo skulls as soon as you descend down the elevator it is quite literally in front of you, go ahead and grab it Okay, for the second server skull, you will descend down these ramps and you will be facing off a bunch of chaos cultists here. As soon as you turn the corner, there will be two chaos cultists here holding position waiting to ambush you. And right behind here is the actual thingamajig that you need. Okay, the last server skull can be found right after you rip off the heavy bolter. And as soon as you're going over here, you will be ambushed by plenty of these little cunts. There's a couple of waves of these guys and you're just gonna want to head straight ahead and the server skull will be right in front of you. Okay, go ahead and pick up ammo, pick up ammo and yeah, there we go. Okay, chapter 16, there are three server skulls. The first one can be found right after you progress through here naturally. To the left is the first one. You also have a an, uh, an grenade pack over here. Okay, and the next server skull can be found in this area where you have this bastard that's shooting uh, the plasma cannon at you. You're just gonna want to eliminate him. Just like so, make sure you don't fall off. Go ahead and grab it. Okay, the last server skull can actually be found as soon as you exit out of the hallway and you encounter one of those chaos drones. Instead of heading to the left where you're supposed to, you're gonna head to the right. And this is the last server skull in the game. And that's it.